so so there so there be uh, there will be a video conferencing uh, 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 system will be available in everybody's house so where they will be able to see all the uh, video uh, all the they will be able to interact with the other person from other part of the world so that this kind of uh, like uh, video conference system will be available in the future all the time so there is, there is no need of more people to work in the office or factory so there will be a video conference system so few people will go to the factory or office and they will share like they have the issue and the manager who is uh, is in charge of the factory or the office like he will be sitting at his house and through the body video conference he will he will like take care of uh, all the issues which which that person is uh, like uh, having in the office or factory and uh, uh, the manager he will like reply to all those person uh, sitting at his house so a uh, very less intervention is uh, human intervention is will be required only few minimal people who are very much important to go to the factory will be going so all the necessary documents related to work can be accessed to centralized uh, server with login and uh, login id and password so uh, even now also if you have to like uh, access your account especially in internet banking so if you are in india or if you are going to europe you can access your account uh, like that kind of system will be developed in the future like if you are in india or if you go to japan or if you go to us or anywhere you can go so you will be able to access your personal data your personal bank accounts and your personal uh, even uh, even work related things also can be accessed to the common server so certain places like hospital etc if the person has to commute he will do so uh, and complete the work in four hours and will come back so uh, like hospital and everything uh, it will be very near to uh, near to the civilization i mean uh, i mean to say like uh, the people will be uh, like they, there will be uh, hospitals schools everything will be near to your locality so that kind of locality will come into uh, into place where the hospitals the schools and the offices everything will be in the very much into walkable distance or you have to commute with the high transport mode so in the next topic we will deal about the transport uh, transportation like how what kind of transport system will be kept uh, kept in the place for the future so uh, when we talk about the future mode of transport they will be we will be talking about how the commuting will be but basically the commuting will be very uh, very smooth and the office everything will be uh, very near to your place or uh, you will be uh, you will be sitting at your house and you will be uh, like taking care uh, through the uh, online video conferencing system so you will be talking to the other person without going uh, going to the office and when there is a requirement you will just go for four hours and you will come back so that kind of a flexible timing will be there uh, for you so that uh, you will be able to uh, be in your house and you will be able to be with your family for more and more time and uh, the work will be fun for you so uh, at present uh, if, if you see uh, life in the india in uh, cities so like uh, commuting itself it takes a uh, 2 to 3 hours in uh, just goes in commuting again you have to work there for 8 hours so by the time you are almost uh, 12 hours is gone just uh, for the office and for commuting so remaining when you come home you will be completely drained with uh, the energy and the only thing what you do is you will eat and sleep that's all you you will not have much time to spend uh, with your children with your family but in future the scenario will change you the commuting time will come down and uh, the the work you will you can work from your house and at presently this is the scenario what is happening like mail the uh, main uh, it companies like google and everybody they are allowing all their employees to work from their house so in uh, other uh, other streams also that kind of uh, system pattern will come where most of the time you can work from your house or if there is any requirement if if there is any requirement you have to commute commute per uh, commute to office and you have you can come back in within maximum 4 hours of time so that will be the scenario in the future so all basic facilities will be available free of charge also the transportation so in the future the transportation all be will be governed by the government and it will provide the free transportation without any charge so if you are now we are paying uh, hefty charges for the trains or the flights or the buses but in future the transportation everything will be free so the average vacation time will be uh, for two months uh, they can go for uh, uh, go to far distant planets here is the underlining point so now we are we able to go to another planet my dear friends 
no we are not able to go to another planet but in future we will be able to go to the another planet called let us say mars or jupiter or saturn or pluto we can just go and with the fraction of second you will be in the pluto and fraction of second you will be in jupiter so that kind of uh, what you called uh, interplanetary uh, travel will be a common thing because now we are able to travel to us or we are able to travel to uk or russia or anywhere uh, we we have that kind of system so in the future we will be able to travel to the in, inter galaxy that means the interplanetary tra uh, travel will be a very common thing in the future so industries which won't exist in the future so retail banking won't be there so we have a lot of banking there so there, there will be there will be only one bank we, we will not have any uh, multiple banks the one bank will take care of all your banking transactions all your banking needs so the retail banking will be missing so new uh, new papers and new, news magazines this is uh, uh, this is the newspaper yes is missing so newspaper and news magazines will be missing tax collection there will there won't be any taxing system as i said uh, so there, there is no need of tax collector so gas stations petrol bunks will not be there airports we are, so the, uh, so if you are traveling from one country to another country so this is the time my dear friends you enjoy uh, traveling or in airports and airlines because in future the airports and airlines will not be there so e even if you see now the scenario uh, the uh, aeroplanes and the uh, uh, what do you call the the uh businesses who are taking care of the airports and airlines they are going to heavy losses because of pan uh, corona pandemic so in future the, I, i believe that there uh, the airlines will be shut down and the airports will be closed so that kind of time is also coming so uh, this book is written ahead of its time it was uh, as, I, as i mentioned to you that this book was written in 1995 so at that time he has uh, told about that there won't be any airports and airlines and if you see the current scenario uh, you can uh, you can directly see that this kind of scenario is happening in real so in future there won't be any airports and airlines so coal mining will not be there in the future so almost the dependence of coal is already uh, like reduced so we are going for renewable energy so uh, in future uh, there will not be any need to go for coal so coal mining will not be there so chemical fertilizers will not be there my dear friends there is lot of health hazards connected with the uh, chemical fertilizers so without chemical free uh, like farming will be done fertilizer free uh, farming will be done so there will not be any chemical fertilizers so all the factories and all the companies relating to fertilizers chemical fertilizers will be shut down there will not be any prisons in the future so like everybody will be conscious of what they are doing they will be Uh, health standards will be more so everybody will have a balance uh, what you call the currency distribution the wealth distribution so there is no need to go and uh, rob the other person so, so so that is the reason there will not be need of any prisons police stations will not be there in the future so tv cable computer networks all this will not be there so ready made garments manufacturing will not be there so landline telephones even uh, now uh, the existence of landline is hardly 5% available only few people are using landline so in the future like uh, landlines will not be available so we'll come to the next section so we will talk about the indigo children and crystal children so what kind of children are there so th these uh, these uh, two categories of children are born with these special abilities so they they to uh, they actually took birth here uh, to increase the vibrations of the earth so all the children who are born after let us say here it is the year everything is mentioned here all the children from long time it is thought that if you study you will get good job good jo good job means paycheck nobody cares about their children interest and uh, they are interested in sports music and other activities so this is how the present scenario of children like uh, they are uh, not given the uh, a free hand to do whatever they want they are forced to do certain thing for to earn uh, to study to get job and again uh, again uh, they are forced to do certain thing so in the in the future it will not be there so children will take care of what they need so uh, they will be choosy they will not be uh, like uh, they will not just obey our uh, instructions but they will be choosy even if you see the present scenario children they uh, the, ch the the little kids what you see now they are like indi indigo children crystal children so they, they uh, if they are determined to do something if they want to 
climb the steps and they want to jump from there so they are determined to do they are not bother whether you are uh, yelling at them or you are scolding them the children are like that so if they want to play in the night one uh, one o'clock also they are ready to play and they are not bother and they will not listen to your instruction so that is how the indigo children will be and uh, we, we can see the uh, glimpse of the children uh, in today's uh, children near in our neighborhood or in our house so the indigo children are born from 1960s and mainly from 1978 so all the persons who are born after 1960s and 1978 are the indigo children they are rebellion from birth and break the monotonous customs their dna is more activated than other children their main purpose is to be happy and he or she performs only those things which they want to do as we discussed my dear friend so these children are very much uh, like uh, designed for, to increase the vibrations of the earth and they are for the welfare of the fellow beings so they will care for the fellow beings so these are the 14 signs of indigo children you can just go through like uh, they uh, like this these are the characteristics of indigo children like they will be strong build they will they, they will be old soul that means they have taken lot of birds on this uh, on this set so that is the reason they are coming here again taking birds to increase the vibration to help these uh, fellow uh, human beings on this earth so so that uh, they can have a uh, healthy living in the future he is a free thinker uh, so head is a non conformist so passionate truth seeker so high in t2 they will be high t2 to the empathetic and compassionate and uh, he will he they will have the leadership qualities also idealistic a personality it's a creative thinking will be there and more more is like uh, they have strong connection with the nature and animals so that is that will be these are the few characteristics which i have mentioned the indiga children are lot light bearers who are driven by the sole purpose in life so the signs are that they want to change the world truth is always the matter uh school wasn't easy so the uh, little time on so you know 1960s and 1978 born so we have seen that in our school it was not easy school day for us because the, uh, like the, these people wanted to change the uh, the pattern what uh, the earlier pattern was so, so they will be a creative natural leader and head strong so these all the all few good characteristics of a uh, indigo children and crystal children so these are again uh, symbols of the crystal child so these people are very much like uh, uh, they communicate uh, telepathically they are very creative they are charismatic personality attractive personalities and they they uh, uh, they do not like violence and uh, they are god bearing people and they have a connection with the gods and angels so all these characteristics are there for the indigo and crystal children so now we come to the next section called the housing like how the housing will be so um, uh, like uh, how uh, so in 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 uh, uh, present scenario so all the major cities are very much crowded and very is much rush is there so in future in the uh, future when the earth is going into uh, it you call the photon band from 2029 that is 2029 our entire solar system will be going into um high energy zone called the photon band for next 2000 years so so all the scenarios are changing because of that so our rotation of earth has been increased earlier in 19 uh, in if you see in 1947 or prior 1930 the rotation of our earth was 7 uh, 7 hertz so the hertz is the what you call the the criteria of the, the rotation of earth is measured so it was 7 hertz but if you see in the 20 uh, 2012 the rotation of earth has increased to 13 hertz that means almost double it has happened so the uh, the 24 hours is not 24 hours anymore so the 24 hours uh, the earth is rotating at um, uh, the higher speed so the day and night are happening very quickly so because the entire solar system is getting ready to go into what you call the photon band very very much quickly so the big cities will turn into a small towns so all the people if you see uh, like most of the people are going out of out of cities they are going into towns if you see the scenario at present in all places of the world they are going into more like uh, towns now and more and more people are moving out of the cities so uh, in future the city will be vacant and uh, most of the people will go into the cities and they will uh, they will stay there so housing and jobs will be available everywhere so people will move to different places and distance places so now with the what you call the online systems at place and we have seen the online uh, communication system 
and will be available at uh, respective places. So most of the people will be working from home. So there is no need for them to commute uh, to the cities or to the workplace to work. So most of the things will be available at the house. So the competitive sports and violent sports, like Jalli Kattu, it is available in Tamil Nadu, you will see. And there are so many uh, sports like uh, the, the killing of whales in few countries. They, seem, they kill the whales just because uh, blue whales, you know, just simply for the sake of fun. So in, I have read some time back an article where the people just go uh, to the ocean and kill the blue whales just for the sake of fun. And the, the blue whales cry like a little child and the, uh, the entire water becomes red because, uh, because of the blood of that blue whale. So this kind of uh, violent sports and competitive sports will not be there in the future. So affordable housing will be available to each and every person with all basic amenities. So today a housing uh, is a dream for a poor person. But in future, everybody will have at least one house to stay. At least roti, kapra and makan will be uh, taken care. That is food, water facilities and housing will be taken care by the government. So uh, everybody will have the affordable housing. So there will not be uh, uh, any problem of basic amenities. So with this, my dear friends, so we'll come to the end of this session and just we'll quickly go through the summary of uh, today's uh, session. So uh, as we have learned that there will not be any stock markets, casinos, individual ID card with chip will be available to everyone for doing transaction across the globe. So most of the things are uh, uh, available now. The other card has already has the chip, which contains all the data, even debit cards, uh, what we are seeing in India is coming with a microchip uh, with it. It has the, all the transactions. So future scenario will be the same. So there will not be no taxes. Now we are paying heavy taxes in the form of direct taxes and indirect taxes. So future, there will not be any taxes, no paperwork, and there will not be. There will be automated system in the place which will take care of uh, all the necessary work. So all the it may be office work or anything. Most of the, the things will be done by the automatic system in the factories and offices. Also, everything will be done automatically. So indigo and crystal children will help the world in increasing the vibration and for smooth transition. So for the globe is going through a smooth transition. That is, it is going from the uh, from third dimension. It has come to the fourth dimension. Uh, on the end of uh, 2012, December 31st, uh, that is on, uh, on uh, January 1st, 2013, we were on the fourth dimension. So uh, after 2029, we'll be in the fifth dimension. So all these children will help us to go into the uh, fifth dimension very smoothly. And uh, there will not be any destruction in this world. So as I said in my earlier classes also, there will not be any, any major destruction. There will be minute destruction maybe here and there, maybe a 10% destruction here and there. Uh, but there will not be major destruction and you will be sitting on your sofa and your entire solar system will be uh, going to the uh, cotton band. It is a high energy uh, zone. So the so entire galaxy will be moved into the entire solar system. Will uh, uh, The sun and the, all the nine planets, everything will be going to the uh, high photon band energy system in future. So after 2029. So the, the time is very much near, my dear friends. Just uh, we have uh, left with only eight years, eight, uh, eight years left to reach by 2029. So uh, shortly we'll be going there. So there will be affordable housing for everyone with all the amenities. So we have seen like uh, there will be affordable amenities and the basic amenities will be available uh, for everyone. So with this, uh, we'll uh, 